for this video but so I'm editing a new way and I'm just recording live and sometimes I don't say exactly what needs to be said in the video and I need to add something post edit and it may sound different I'm in a different energy I'm in a different it's a different day and I just want it it kind of to be known sometimes people I just want it to be known like sometimes I get a little bit irritated when things are a little bit out of whack that's just how I am um, what I'm saying is that when you want to make post edits sometimes it kind of like where do you kind of because I feel like this is gonna be a recurring thing for me and I just kind of want to make a distinction between the edits and kind of like to listen a little bit more but I just wanted to add a bit of emphasis in the video through visual means so what I'm gonna do so I need to add an edit to this part of the video I basically cut it out because I made a mistake it's just gonna be a waste of people's time so I'm just gonna be explaining what I did here um, because I didn't explain that in the video and then um, so I'm gonna add a little pause or something like that right here and then it can like hang out right here or whatever so I'm gonna add a make it kind of transparent um, so everything on the back could be seen I'm hoping that works if not we'll try a couple different things but and maybe if I make it a little bit darker this portion of the video because this is a portion of the video where I'm just and it's like 39 seconds so um, I think I can use 39 seconds, but if I need to cut anything off, I can cut it off and just be like, and this is, I, I can just blend it into somewhere. I don't really know. We'll figure it out as we go. That's a problem. That's a, not a problem, but that's the thing with, um, editing. You just gotta always keep going back and forth. Editing, it really depends on your process. So I kind of. kind of like for these visual things want to turn up your brightness screen brightness so you can actually see it how people look with it turn it's with sound and brightness colors you just want whatever you're working on to be at its max so when yeah it's just just how it goes let's see I'm, I don't know oh they're kind of like that I already did that. Okay, cool. Kind of. And then I'm gonna add a pause. And I'm gonna use Canva again. You use probably I use Adobe too. I haven't been using that in a while. I know they are working with Content Cal. Oh, I just can't have that many um, subscriptions. How many subscriptions can a girl have? So I'm gonna get a graphic. this black just like oh, I don't know we'll see so I like this pink I mean I can make it like a and I feel like I'm gonna put it on the left left side and I don't know that seems good enough for size to be a different color kind of like this orange C -c 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 -c. sepia kind of like that that vibe so I'm just gonna download it in translucent as an image Download it. Okay, it should be. <clears throat> and then I recent downloads. Why did we just do this? My movie right now. And then we're gonna add it here on the top. Perfect. 
and then again so we can edit everything together why is it been moving I think it's anim why would it be animated though It's a little bit dark to me. Like so. One cut away. Picture in picture. Hmm. What do you guys think? I might change it to a different color. But you can do a lot of stuff with this method again. Um just anything overlays adding stickers however um, you just download everything transparent and it works so where is my thing I think I might do an orange to see where is it okay reverse it kind of like pink I don't want to I just want to change it for some reason some reason the need to change it. Kind of like amber. Maybe there's a different pause button I like. Kind of like that one. Ooh. Let's see. Let's see, I, I just always. This is how I never get things done. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's see. just want it to be applied to everything and just be kind of minimal um, okay let's do that hit download download all right so back to this minimize you There you go. Perfect, perfect. I, I like it. It, it. it pops out. People are knowing something's happening. It's not normal. Or it's just, I, I like it. And like I said, you can do this with stickers. I'll, I'll do a lot of little tricks you can do with Canva for editing, even over live videos. You can really make some cool videos from Canva. Not even using iMovie, you can go on Canva. Like Canva's a little bit... Um, limited with like the editing tools I mean iMovie has like is like a lot more um, things you can do on it but um, compared to Canva um, you probably only have like <laughs> five options um, but that's fine they do a lot for me for $12 like I hope they do not raise it it's it's like a Netflix subscription if you're a content creator canva for sure if you're a social media manager social media manager for sure get canva there's a lot just get canva anything if you just like making things want to make clothes you can make so many things just you can make your own t-shirts there's uh, this is not sponsored i am i love there's a couple things i love even if I'm not sponsored. I feel like sponsors are so taboo right now in my mind, but I would only like Canva is definitely something I would talk about a lot. I want to do Adobe uh, Creative Cloud a little bit more, but Shopify, I'm, those are all my go to apps right now. So, yes, this is just my little video, and thank you for watching. All right, okay, see you guys. Bye.
quick mistake here. I had forgotten the process, but basically I'm just gonna transfer the screenshot into Canva, then pixelate it with the options they have, but you don't need to use Canva. You can use kind of any app that pixelates or website that would pixelate it. I'm sure there's a lot of options.